Greetings friends. Watch Refrigeration News for Friday, March 25, 2022 on our channel. EPTA Service presented an innovative solution line on. Rai Intex has released solution for cryotherapy. Warwickshire Pub installs Panasonic Nano EX to improve indoor environment. The Lab Center of Sanwa's Central R&D Center was accredited by China National Accreditation Service for Conformity Assessment. Registration is open for 2022 ASHRAE Annual Conference in Toronto. Excellent prospects for children to 2022, innovations, networking, and future prospects. So, first news today. EPTA Service presented Innovative Solution Line on. EPTA Service is an EPTA brand specialized in after sales assistance and consulting, which innovates the refrigeration sector with the original line on digital solution. This 4.0 evolution is dedicated to the ERP, Costin, and Bonnet Neve. Technology is transforming consumer habits in the current panorama. Servitization, understood as the integrated offer of products and services, is the new frontier for the food and AMP, beverage and ho. Read more the news on our website today. Second news today. Mirai Intex has released solution for cryotherapy. Mirai Intex introduces unique and especially developed refrigeration machine added to its product portfolio. Same as the rest of the manufacturer refrigeration machines, only air is used as a refrigerant and no oil is used for the machine's lubrication, making Mirai cold the most environmentally friendly ultra-low temperature. ULT, Refrigeration Solution. Mirai Cold 10D is the letter D stands for Direct Expansion. Read more the news on our website today. Third news today. Warwickshire Pub installs Panasonic Nano EX to improve indoor environment. The new in pub in Warwickshire, a community-owned pub dating back to 1750, needed a new approach to heating and cooling to create a welcoming and pleasant environment for its customers. Panasonic Etheria air conditioning units with Nano EX were recommended as the ideal solution by installer Oli Thorndale of Thorndale Heating and Amp, Cooling. The residents of the small village in Norton Lindsay, Warwickshire, purchased the pub in 2016 to maintain its key role as the social hub of the village. Read more the news on our website today. Fourth news today. The lab center of Sanwa's Central R and Amp. D Center was accredited by China National Accreditation Service for Conformity Assessment. On Jan.12, 2022, the Lab Center of Sanwa's Central R and AMP, D Center was accredited by CNIS, China National Accreditation Service for Conformity Assessment, and the license number is L15826. The Lab Center of Sanwa's Central R and AMP, D Center was founded in 2013. It aims to provide tests for clients' research and development of new products, and assist clients with different researches on new products and the application of cutting-edge technology. Read more the news on our website today. Fifth news today. Registration is open for 2022 ASHRAE Annual Conference in Toronto. Registration is now open for the 2022 ASHRAE Annual Conference, June 25th to 29th, at the Sheraton Center Hotel, Toronto. The five-day conference includes sessions addressing current trends and technologies in the HVAC and AMP, our industry, as well as tours, social events and a keynote message from Freddie Lafardi, nationally recognized STEM educator and subject of IMAX film, Dream Big. Read more the news on our website today. Sixth news today. Excellent prospects for Chilvent 2022, innovations, networking, and future prospects. Chilventa, the leading international fair for refrigeration technology and the most important gathering of international refrigeration, AC, ventilation and heat pump experts will celebrate its comeback in Nuremberg from 11 October 13, 2022. Already, all participants are feverishly anticipating this massive reunion at the first on-site edition of the event since 2018. Read more the news on our website today. That's all. Share the news with your friends. Follow Refrigeration News on social networks. Please find the links below.